everyone. I'm going to read The Bad Seed to You by Jory John and Pete Oswald. I'm a bad seed. A bad seed. Ooh. I don't think you want to get in his way. Mm. Oh yeah, it's true. The other seeds, they look at me and they say, that seed is so bad. And when they think I'm not listening, they mumble. There goes the bad seed. Oh no. But I can hear them. I have a good hearing for a seed. How bad am I? You really want to know? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, I never put things back where they belong. I'm late to everything and I tell long jokes with no punchlines. I never wash my hands, eek, or my feet. I lie about pointless stuff and I cut in line every time. I stare at everybody, I glare at everybody, I finish everybody's sentences and I never listen. And I do lots of other bad things too, know why? because I'm a bad seed, a bad seed. I just can't help it. Sure, I wasn't always this bad. I was born in a humble, I was born a humble seed on a simple sunflower in an unremarkable field. I'd say that's pretty remarkable, very beautiful. I had a big family, seeds everywhere. We found ways of having fun. We were close. Here he is with his family. But then the petals dropped and our flower drooped. Oh no. It's kind of a blur. I remember a bag, fresh sunflower seeds, delicious. Mm. And everything went dark. And then, and then, a giant! I think he's at a baseball game. I thought I was a goner. I thought I was done for. I screamed and I hollered. Ah! I was spit out at the last possible second. That was a close call, friends. I flew through the air and landed under the bleachers with a huge thud. When I woke up, it was dark outside. I had a wad, a wad of gum had softened my fall. I felt okay, but something had changed in me. I had become a different seed entirely. I became a bad seed. Under the bleachers, and there's his gum. Mm, watch out. A bad seed. That's right. I stopped smiling. I kept to myself. I drifted. I was a friend to nobody and a, and a bad to everybody. I was lost on purpose. I lived inside a soda can and I didn't care and it suited me. What a lonely life. Until recently, I've made a big decision. I decided I don't want to be a bad seed anymore. I'm ready to be happy. It's hard to be good when you're so used to being bad, but I'm trying. I'm taking it one day at a time. Sure, I still forgot to listen, and I still show up late, and I still talk during movies. I do all kinds of other bad stuff. But I also say thank you, and I say please, and I smile, and I hold doors open for people, not always, but sometimes. And even though I still feel bad, sometimes I also feel kind of good. Sort of a mix. And all I can do is keep trying and keep thinking, I'm not such a bad seed after all. Mm. Mm. Hey, look, there goes the bad seed. Actually, he's not all that bad anymore. I heard that. Well, I hope you enjoyed the bad seed, friends, and I'll catch you all later. Bye.